So I think going into consulting and kind of figuring out how you enter into that whole space, that was probably the one thing I questioned is, how do I sell this? How do I sell who I am? Um, And that's where looking at staffing firms that actually do this, but I didn't want a body shop. There's so many, having been on the other side of the desk, where I would sign a consulting agreement and then what would come in would be some junior consultant that I felt like we had to train. And that's not what I wanted. I didn't want that for me because I felt I brought something different to the table um, with the years of experience that I had. I wanted to be able to trust because this person is selling me to organizations and I wanted to know that there was integrity as far as in the, the conversations that we had, the work that we did, and also that they had really good clients, that I would be staffed on projects that also met with kind of my values and what I was looking for. That I did spend time trying to understand what do different people bring. And for me, I also had the challenge from a consulting perspective that I wanted to limit my travel. So really understanding did my values align with the values of the firm and the company that I was looking at? And then the people, do I just have a natural relationship um, and feel connected with those people? Because this is something I didn't, when I enter things, I don't do it 10%, I do it 100%. And I knew it's kind of like a marriage almost of, building, you have to have trust and a relationship and know that you're going to have ups and downs, but that you can weather through and, and both achieve what you're wanting to achieve um, from that relationship.